Charles, Louisiana is in the black trunks. Osmo Alexander, one of the top Muay Thai fighters in the world, is in the white trunks. Both men making their pro MMA debut tonight. Again, Quay Hagen, 15 fights in amateur MMA, a record of 9 and 6. Alexander has never had an amateur MMA fight, but 55 pro Muay Thai fights for Alexander. 40 victories, 14 losses, one draw. And again, Alexander down. And again, Quay Hagen lets it stand. Shopping low kick to answer by Alexander. Well, the crowd's certainly behind Quay Hagen, the hometown fighter. Fighters standing in the center of the Bellator cage, both looking to get off. That's what they're both having trouble with. I mean, Alexander's doing well with that late kick, but not throwing a lot of jabs, not getting inside and initiating like he should. Are you surprised that we haven't seen the tight clinch from Alexander? I, I, I'm surprised he hasn't committed. He really tried to pull that head down and get that tight clinch. He's comfortable fighting at a distance, but he's not throwing enough jabs to get inside. That's been his problem. Stick left jab there a moment ago by Quay Hagen. So much of judging mixed martial arts comes down to personal preference. What you appreciate, what you look for, really truly determines what you understand. Well, another problem is you're fighting a hometown guy. Quinn Higgins is from this city. It's not easy. You don't want to lose this in the hands of the judges if you're Cosmo Alexander. It's not a smart idea. It's been, it's been a very close fight anyway. Alexander backed off a moment ago, coming back forward again. When the judges be looking at Alexander's aggression, mainly coming forward, or Quay Higgins' elusiveness in his counter strike. The most effective shot so far of this fight has been that late kick of Alexander, but it's they're easy to overlook. I mean, even when uh, Quay Higgins throws a shot that's been well blocked, the crowd reacts a lot of teeth to see throwing that big right hand. Oh, nice left hook. That hook and landed back punch of the fight for the regular the round private fighter. They're not the fight, but of this round number three. Quay Hagen back to pumping the jab. Alexander's hands are so high, so technical. Another kick. But he hasn't been busy enough with those punches. Hasn't thrown enough shots. Oh, good left hook! Quay Hagen pulls his way out. Now forming under the left eye of Josh Quay Hagen. Alexander now had his success. He's just finding his range now. Quay just slapping that left, literally slapping it as he opened the fingers. Just with that right hand. Into the guillotine. Not passing guard. Quay Hagen on top, minute 45 left. Alexander holding the guard, and he lost it defensively. It's Quay Hagen inside control. Oh, no guard, no guillotine. Hanging off that of a waste of time. Short right hand now by Quay Hagen. Under 90 seconds remaining in this third and final round. Closed guard now by Alexander. What can the purple belt get done from his back? Alexander opening his guard. Quay Hagen posturing on both knees, looking to go on with the full ground of town. He stays on top and controls this position. He can steal this round. Close guard again from Alexander. Right hand now by Quay Hagen. Alexander opening his guard, trying to strip. Under a minute now remaining in this third and final round. Good right to the body. Alexander turned on that. Short effort right now to the body by Quay Hagen. So he's just going to put that head against the fence and make this position a lot easier on him. Alexander really trying to strip, trying to be active on his own. This is Quay Hagen playing offense from the top position. Alexander back to the close guard. Open the moment to early yeah. his ankles. Four right hands to the body by Josh Boy uh, If you look at the referee to stand in yeah, there, only 15 seconds left. That's not enough time. It's only 10 seconds left. He's staying busy enough, but I can see why Nathan Herzog is not standing this up. Boy yeah. Hagen pounces Alexander back to his feet. The bell and the end of the fight. Oh.